Hi, I'm Jean Grossbeck of the Grossbeck Group and Compass Real Estate. I just heard someone talking um, who was an expert in real estate, and they were saying that if you find a house you like and you have not whole, sold your home first, uh, the first decision you need to make is whether or not you can carry two mortgages. And uh, he was suggesting that that would put you in a position of strength. I personally disagree with that, so I thought I would let you know why. Um, if you uh, can't, uh, if you find a house you like and you've not sold your home first, there's the process of putting in a contingent offer. Now that does put you at a position of perhaps not having as strong of, of an offer. However, before you decide that that is not the tack to take, your realtor should contact the other real estate agent and chat about what the seller is interested in. They may not want a quick close. They may be willing to, to um, give you time to sell your home. They may be wanting to uh, get their home under contract so that um, they can you know, move forward with different plans. It's possible that they're gonna rent. It's possible that the seller would allow you to rent back. That's actually pretty common. We do an actual rental agreement so that the parties are protected and the person renting back, which would be uh, the former owner, gets rental insurance. Uh, so there's a lot of different ways uh, to do it. We've had uh, sellers carry paper, carry a contract for a short period of time uh, until you're able to perhaps get your home sold. So there's not a cookie cutter answer to that question and I was disappointed that that was what they gave. You don't necessarily have to put yourself in a position where you would have two mortgages. There's a lot to negotiating a contract rather than just price and that comment was only focused on perhaps price point. But there's lots of other things that can be worked out. So make sure that you're working with a full-time experienced real estate broker that has negotiated these kinds of intricacies in a contract before so that you can get the outcome that you want. I'm Jean Grossbeck. We would love to work for you. Please give us a call, text, email, whatever works best for you.